Hey YouTube, uh, thought I'd show you what's going on in my neck of the woods today. So let me turn you around, I'm standing in my carport. So here you go. Getting a nice amount of snowfall. I don't know how well that's coming in. Hopefully pretty well. But it's been snowing most of the morning, not real hard and heavy. You can even still see driveway cleared off from the last time it snowed, but uh, we probably have about six inches or so on the ground, um, and now we're getting more, but this isn't supposed to be anything too substantial, but thought I'd show that off a little bit, and then I'm going to do a tin opening here in just a second. I'm going to sit down and get situated of Freiburg and Trier's Blackjack. Alright, so new tobacco to me. Haven't seen a lot of it on YouTube, uh, so I'm really interested to try it out. Uh, if you've had this, let me know your thoughts. Um, I'm going to do a tin opening, talk about it a little bit, and then um, give my first thoughts and last thoughts of the bowl. So I'll be back in a second. Alright, for the sake of ease, I have this just sitting on the uh, trunk of my car <laughs> uh, in the carport because it's just a little bit simpler. But we have uh, the tin here, brand new. Uh, not opened yet. I'm going to try to pop the seal with one hand. I'm going to guess that that's not going to work, but we'll give it a shot. This isn't going to work, but let's see here. Let's see if I can do this. Put this in the shot, so. Get my pipe nail in. There we go. Well, partially. There we go. All right. So, back up, let's see, I'll do a quick sniff of it. Hmm, has that uh, really nice um, kind of dried fruit smell, uh, apricots and uh, raisins and things like that. So, as we open up the paper and take a look at it, um, this is kind of what I expected based on, not really reviews, but just some things I've heard about it, is that even while it's called Blackjack, uh, there's very, very little dark tobacco in here. It's kind of some, maybe some medium brown, but mostly light brown. But it's a very thick cut. I mean, it's it's not a flake, and it's really not a broken flake, but I would say it's it's definitely different, different than a ready rub. Uh, they're almost all these kind of long... Let's see if I can focus in on it. Nope, sorry. These kind of long strands... Uh, of tobacco, so uh, it's quite a bit different than anything I've seen before, actually. Uh, so that's kind of exciting, something new. So I'm going to get my pipe lit up, or packed up and lit up, and I'll let you know my first thoughts after the first couple of puffs. So, uh, right off the bat, one of the first things I notice is that this tobacco lit very easily. I did kind of an unusual packing method where I just kind of stuffed it in there, only packed about three quarters of a bowl. I don't know if it's because of how cold it is outside or the nature of the tobacco, but it felt almost a little bit stiff. But one thing I got out of it uh, that I didn't get in the smell is kind of this, just a hint of uh, a lemony taste, but it's mostly just a nice woodsy Virginia um, taste, no, nothing too out of the ordinary. Uh, n not a whole lot to say, I guess, about it yet, except that it's pleasant. I mean, it certainly is pleasant. Right off the bat, it, it reminds me a lot of uh, Samuel uh, Gaweth or Gaweth's um, Golden Glow. Uh, pretty mild, uh, not huge on flavor. It's not as fruity as the Golden Glow was. This is, just has a hint of lemon, but kind of like a woodsy, almost... Yeah, maybe like, kind of like smelling cedar or or something like that, but um, not, not very strong, just, just very light. So I'm going to enjoy this bowl, and I'll be back with some final thoughts. Hey, what's up, guys? Well, I'm nearing the end of this bowl. 
of the Freiburg and Trier uh, Blackjack. <clears throat> and it's really nice. It's, it's much more complex than I originally thought starting out. It's a very, very creamy smoke. <clears throat> very, very creamy and woodsy. Um, not really like any other Virginia I've had before. I highly recommend it. If, if you like Virginia tobaccos and like a variety of Virginias, this is really nice. So, um... I think it's reasonably priced. I think I got it for like ten dollars a ten at uh, Pipes and Cigars. <clears throat> but if you like Virginias, I'd say check it out. Granted, this is just a first bowl for me, and I'm by no means any kind of professional reviewer. So, hope you guys have a chance to enjoy the weather uh, where you're at. Maybe it's as pretty as it is here. Uh, for those of you who are putting out videos that springs already came, maybe spring comes at the end of January in the south, but uh, definitely not here in Iowa. So, I'll give you a shot of the snowfall. I hope that it's showing up as well on the camera as it does um, when you're actually standing here. So, anyway. Hope you guys have a great and wonderful weekend. Enjoy the Super Bowl tomorrow. And we'll talk to you guys next time.